Biotechnology is the manipulation of living things to make useful products. What are GMOs? GMO is an acronym for Genetical Modified Organism. The term GM foods or GMOs is most commonly used to refer to crop plants created for human or animal consumption using the latest molecular biology techniques. How to make GMOs? To produce a GMO, you can use a standard technique to transfer a gene using a bacterium. There are six main steps. The first, it picks up the gene of the DNA of the organism that is equipped and inserted into a plasmid. The second, the restriction enzymes cut the DNA at specific target sequences. The third, the DNA ligase seals the DNA. In this way, you obtain the recombinant DNA. The fourth, in reality, it is necessary to have a DNA sequence that regulates the expression of the gene. The sequence is called a promoter. The fifth, then you need a piece of DNA that tells the cell that the sequence is over, terminator. The sixth, finally, a marker gene is used to identify organisms with a recombinant DNA. Some GMOs examples. Tomato, the first GMO. In 1994, in the USA, the tomato was the first transgenic plant put on the market. Its main features are larger and longer shelf life. GM papaya. In the late 1980s, the University of Hawaii began developing a papaya cultivar resistant to papaya ring spot virus. To do this, certain viral genes encoding capsid proteins were transferred to the papaya genome. These viral capsid proteins elicit something similar to an immune response from the papaya plant. These new, genetically modified papaya plants are no longer exposed to infection, allowing farmers to cultivate the fruit even when the virus is widespread. The first virus resistant papayas were commercially grown in a way in 1999. Transgenic papayas now cover about 1000 hectares of three quarters of the total Hawaiian papaya crops. GM Salmon Genetic engineering has created a GM salmon that grows more quickly than usual and consumes less food. Its use can reduce farming costs and increase production meeting a growing demand for the consumption of fish in most of the world. Dates In the graphic are highlighted in green the states with the largest extension of GMO crops, while the graphic lines show the total of cultivated hectares in green, in blue industrialized countries and in red the developing countries.